even on a night when the shots weren't falling, you had a chance. Um, yeah. What did you see in, in, in terms of what you were able to do defensively down the stretch of the rec of the fourth quarter? Yeah, it, uh, it's disappointing, um, you know. But there's a lot of positives to take, and you know, I understand. I always say I'm going, going to take positives from the game, even in losses, and you know that's who we are. Uh, but there were a lot of positives, and you know, down the stretch, we said, you know, we understand we play tomorrow. Um, we said it with about six minutes left. Hey, we're gonna make one push here. Give it about a minute and a half. We were down 16, and these guys came back. They fought. Um, man, I, like, I, I give so much credit to our, our players and, you know, guys, too, getting yo-yoed in and out in terms of Gorgie. You know, we're trying to give Cat a, a rest. Um, all these guys, I mean, people have bought into their roles, and um, it's a special group in our locker room, and I learned a lot more about them. What happened on that last play where, I mean, you had a, kind of a pile up in the corner, yeah. a little bit of... Yeah, we, we knew they were going to switch everything, um, you know, so we, we tried to get a slip to the basket. Uh, we heard them call out a slip early. Um, we tried to get, you know, they ended up switching. They did a nice job of it, um, and then we, uh, we just didn't get a good look. What clicked defensively down the stretch? I think it was 16 straight possessions Denver couldn't score. What, uh, mm -hmm. what changed there? I, mean, I think our defensive intensity turned up a notch. We, we need that for, you know, full 48, um, you know, and Guys did a number of things in terms of, uh, you know, playing without fouling, um, you know, playing, you know, where we wanted to keep Jokic uh, away from being a playmaker, um, how we were guarding his pick and rolls. And, uh, you know, so we did a lot of good things. What do you think of the pace you guys played at tonight? Uh, it was slower, but, you know, that, that team doesn't play at a, at a very, you know, fast pace. And, you know, no excuses, but we're still learning. We have, we're still learning you know, how to play without a guy who's a natural point guard um, right now. And, you know, I give th those guys a lot of credit. Our, you know, Jarrett, J.O. played some point. Jordan McLaughlin, Wig, obviously, you know, they've, they've been doing a um, commendable job. You talked a lot about defending ball screen actions after the Friday game. How did you feel you handled that tonight and specifically Carl on Jokic? Pretty good. Um, gave up 100 points in a overtime game. You know, I feel I feel good about it. I wish we made some more shots. You know, hey, if we go 13 percent, shoot 13 percent from three, and that team is a very good team, and credit goes to them in that locker room. And uh, you know, there's a reason they're seven and two. But if we take a team like that to overtime, um, you know, while shooting 13 percent, I like where we're trending. Coach, with the threes, a lot of times when something isn't working, guys can have a tendency to shy away from it at any point tonight, especially as the game got went on, did you have to reinforce that idea or do any encouraging of keep taking that three? Yeah, yeah, uh, I always encourage it. Um, but, you know, I want to make sure they're, they're positive threes too in terms of, you know, where, you know when, where we're getting them in the shot clock, um, you know, things like that, time to score situations late in game. Um, you know, it's, uh, hey, it, it's the NBA. You know, that, that's a good defensive team, very good in the half court. Um, for us to really beat, you have to beat a team like that. They're not going to beat themselves. So we, we needed to play at a little bit quicker pace. Um, and, uh, but we did a lot of positive things. Ryan, you mentioned Jared playing point guard. He seemed a little indecisive in the beginning, but seemed like he got a little bit better as the game went along. Did he show you anything of, mm -hmm. of how he could maybe handle the position if he needed yeah. to going forward? Yeah, I, respectfully, I thought he, play, he played a nice floor game. Um, you know, I thought he... he him and him and Andrew, you know, you can pick and choose who's the starting point guard at the moment. You know, they're they're both uh, handling the ball. So I thought he, he made some nice reads. Um, I thought he was able to get to the basket. Um, we're going to continue to work on finishing as a group. Uh, you know, we'll continue to work on our shooting, work on a number of things. But um, a lot of positives to take from this. One positive also being, you know, our crowd on a Sunday afternoon game. I thought they really helped us through towards the end too. So there were a lot of a lot of good things. I feel good about going to Detroit right now. Thank you.